very special video for you guys. Uh, we are gonna be unboxing Liberty Vogue's premium full body kit and it's the first one in Taiwan. Okay, so let's start with the front bonnet hood. As you can see here, it has a special air scoop, very different from the bonnet you see now on the Jimny. And let's go further. Let's, uh, let's see what else we have in the box. We have the Liberty Box uh, badge and also Gmini badge. Also here we have some uh, certificate of authenticity. So here we have some, uh, let's check, some Liberty Walk stickers. It's going to be perfect. And uh, here we have a certificate of authenticity. So this is certificate of authenticity indicating that each of the body kit part is real. Let's see what we have here. So this huge massive piece is the bumper. Look at it, it's, it's amazing. The next part is the G-Mini front grille. And as you can see, we have now a central opening compared to the one that uh, Jimmy originally has. So what else? Uh, we have four fender flares and they're very iconic to Liberty War. Um, they're very wide and they would go right here. It's, it's perfect for all SUVs. So here we have the front roof spoiler. It's quite, quite big. And at the rear we have the spoiler lip. It's gonna make it look more meaner and more lowered. And in this box we have the LED G-Wagon lights. Authenticity sticker. And it's similar for all uh, body kit parts. If you turn the spoiler, then you can notice the sticker again. The body kit is not yet finished. We still have wheels. And these are very special wheels. So Liberty Walk has collaborated with Ghostline and if you look closer here we have the Liberty Walks logo and also Ghostline logo and these are special to Jimny. And of course the G-Wagon transformation is not going to be complete without FI exhaust. So here we have the Volvotronic version for Jimny. We have two versions, one is the Valve version and the other one is not the Valve version. Here we have the Volvotronic one and let's see what's inside. So first things we can see here, we have the, the Volvotronic muffler. Let me try and unpack it. So here it is, this is how it looks like. And uh, here you can see we have a special hangers that uh, are specially designed so that we can position the exhaust to the side. So after the Volvotronic muffler, we have the side exit pipe which makes this exhaust very special because then the full transformation to G-Wagon is, is complete. And here we have the exhaust tips. What makes it special is that they are identical to the G63 model and they come in two options. So this is the first option, the standard chrome silver one and the second one is in diamond black. And uh, of course here we have some uh, necessary wiring and also a gas tank. Last but not least, here here is the FI exhaust, Valtronic control module and also the remote controller. Our FI exhaust tips are identical to the ones for the GCC3. They of course would come out at the side of the car. Okay, check it out. exhaust and on my right we have the stock Jimny's body kit and on my left we have the Liberty Walk uh, finished uh, body kit and uh, come closer let's uh, let's examine it so let's first cover the the front bumper 
and uh, what we can notice immediately is that the headlights have been changed from the middle position to the lower section of the bumper and also now we have a central exit grille and you can notice in the middle we have the beautiful LB badge. The second thing is that you can notice is, is the color of, of the body kit. Uh, it was specially designed so that it matches the original stock color. So the next part of the body kit is the white fender flares and you can see that they have been colored in matte black and what's so special ab about the coloring that has been done to the, to the body kit is that the fender flares blend so much more nicely into the rest of the body kit into the front bumper and you can see it has been done with the matte black coloring next are the 16 inch black liberty walk and ghost line collaboration wheels specially for liberty walks complete body kit version and also we have bf goodrich chocolate pattern tires and that give more aggressive off-road feeling now we are at the rear of the car and there are a couple things we can notice so first are these red led headlights and we can also see that the casing for them has been recolored to match the body kit of jimny okay so let's focus on the roof now so at the back we have the spoiler which has been colored to matte black and the whole roof has been colored to matte black and also wrapped in satin black and another thing about the roof is the front roof spoiler identical to the G63 G class and it has also been colored to matte black. So to finish the body kit review we have the front hood with a functional air scoop and the color has been chosen to match the body kit of Jimny and also the last last piece is that the rear mirrors have been recolored to matte black. And of course, the Jiminy transformation would not be complete without FI exhaust, side exit, Valvetronic exhaust system, which produces iconic V8 sound with the Jiminy's 1.5 liter engine. So what do you think of these changes? Tell us in the comments below. What's your favorite body kit part? And what do you think of FI exhaust sound? And thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell for all the notifications. See ya!